Real change vendors are individuals who make a choice to sell the real change newspaper to earn personal income. They buy the paper for 35 cents and resell it on the street for the $1 cover price. Most vendors are people who are presently or formerly homeless. All are low income. Up to 400 individuals sell real change newspapers each month. Real change is a hand up, not a handout. The paper exists to provide opportunity and a voice for low income and homeless people while taking action for economic justice. Vendors are at the core of that mission. Most vendors have a regular turf where they sell the paper to people in the neighborhood each week. This connection across class informs thousands of readers while improving the lives of hundreds of vendors. All year long, Real Change honors Vendors of the Week. Selection as a Vendor of the Year involves the entire Real Change community. More than 30 individuals were nominated this year by staff, board members, and volunteers. Eventually, four finalists were presented for a decisive vote by Real Change vendors themselves. The 2012 Vendors of the Year are Sharon Jones and Addis Michael Jr. If you ask any of them down there or they walk up and say, you say, have you been to uh, Sharon's house? The first thing they're going to tell you is, yeah, you got to take your shoes off when you go in there. <laughs> so I guess I could watch it too. And I love me some football. You had to learn the rules, the regulations, the calls, and all that stuff. So I stuck with it. Now I'm a diehard for football. You know, I'm going to tell you nothing but the truth, so help me. <laughs> But I was an adopted child. I got adopted at the age of three, and I didn't understand the word when they tried to explain it to me. I was just growing up just like every other child. And then as I was coming up, my mother really didn't care for me. I don't know why, I just was the oldest kid, but she just tried to do everything she could to, to do what she wanted to do to me. So I, some kind of way along the lines, I reached my hand out, I needed help. I really needed some help. I mean, I went through everything trying to survive the streets of Washington, D.C. I really did. So then when I got out here, you know, you know, my whole life just changed. I was finally, I got away from D.C., you know. We're just standing there with a the dollar paper, but it is a job. You know, you can handle it like a job, and you can make a lot just standing there. You really can. And, and, and just be kind. Speak. Smile. Smile. Real change is a smiling job. Just smile. And it, it'll bring on it'll bring on more customers than you probably want. <laughs> These people like real change. They're real change readers out there. They really like that paper and I like taking it to them. You know? This was this was like uh, a long stretch of thirty years, you know, addiction. But during that time, um, yeah, I was homeless, you know. But you know, I seen the guys used to come up to me and say, why are you, why are you panhandling? You could sell some real change, you know. Working for real change sort of brought me out of my addiction by constantly buying papers from me all the time and always having nice things to say. Even sometime when I didn't feel good, uh, people came by and gave me smiles and they brought my paper. And that made me come out, man. That that made me stop eventually, you know, uh, drinking. It, it, you know, I slowed it down eventually, stopped. I got what I need from this, you know. I got what I need. And that's a chance to have my life back. Real change have given me that. And basically, you get to set your own standards. And I say to myself a lot of times, I'm going to be polite to everybody, whether, whether they're drunk, whether they're high, or whether they're mentally ill, whatever the case might be. If they don't like you, you know, and they say mean things, you can set a standard to say you're not going to be negative, you're going to be positive. You can set that standard. And, 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 then, and then you can work at it, and you can be successful at it. Real change extends dignity and self-determination into the lives of those who often have few other legitimate income earning opportunities. Selling around 20,000 copies of the newspaper each week, vendors are connecting across class and making real change.